This is a delicacy of the bears. They like these. And we'll have to label what the name is later because we don't know what the name is right now. Can you hear the raven? It's up there somewhere. This park is also loaded with bald eagles. Saw four of them flying together yesterday. And up ahead is another totem, so we'll be up there shortly. On the second attempt to beat the Indians, this was a Russian warship. And this is where we are right now at the battlefield and the 1804 shoreline. The fort was in a regular square, its longest side looking toward the sea, constructed of wood so thick and strong that the shot from my guns could not penetrate it at the short distance of a cable's length. So here's the captain of the Russian warship. And I'm not even going to try and pronounce his name, but that's who he is. So let's go on into the fort battle, battle site. And we have another totem in here. This is where the battle took place. The only reason the Klingets left because they were running low on ammunition and had nothing to fight the Russians with. So during the night, they left. And of course, Russia declared victory and the rest is history. Of course, at the bottom of the totem is the raven that you hear. The bottom figure represents a raven helmet worn during the, the battle. And this is kind of a memorial stone to the war or battle. It wasn't really a war, it was just a battle. But this is it. Couldn't have been too much of a battle because there sure isn't a lot of space. This is a mosquito legend pole. The top figure is the village watchman. A Klingit figure associated with the creature from which mosquitoes originated is the second totem on the pole. Below that is a female bear 
quoting the hunter who was lost in the woods and he became her husband. The large figure at the base is probably a devil fish or octopus recognized as a bear. The rock under which the octopus lives is represented by the face shown between its ears. And the octopus holds the man who went to live in the octopus village under the sea and married the octopus princess.